Well hello again, it's Reverend Peter and we continue with our reflections during this Holy Week. In today's reflection, Jesus carries the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. We say together, because your holy cross has redeemed the world. So we take a moment to reflect. Christ bore the cross, felt the pain and the humiliation for each one of us. Let's pause together. Our reading is from Mark chapter 15, verse 20. After mocking him, they stripped him of the purple cloak, put his own clothes on him, then they led him out to crucify him. So I have with me a holding cross this morning. If you have a piece of wood handy, would you like to pick it up and hold it? If not, just use your imagination. Imagine a piece of wood that Christ carried on his shoulders, already bleeding and scarred from the beatings and the humiliation before the soldiers, and then being paraded across Jerusalem to the place of death. We think about this wood from a small little stem with its first shoots it would have grown up gone through many different seasons before it was cut down eventually certainly most furniture would have started life in a similar way and have grown to massive proportions a giant tree but then came the time to cut it down and yet it was still incredibly heavy if you take something really heavy and try and hold it as I hold my Bible here. At first it's easy to hold it up, but as time goes by it becomes incredibly heavy. Think about Christ carrying the burden of the cross, but also the burden of the sins of the world. He did this out of love for each one of us and for all those who have ever lived and all those who will live in the future. God's love is not held by time, reaches out to all of us from that cross. So let's think about how it feels to be overburdened. What is the heaviest kind of load? What is the greatest pain? And what does it say? What does it mean when we look at the cross and we think of it as a thing of beauty? Let us pray. Lord Jesus, you carried the cross through the rough streets of Jerusalem. Be with those who were loaded with burdens beyond their strength. You bore the weight of our sins when you carried the cross. Help us to realise the extent and the cost of your love for each one of us. To you, Jesus, bearing a cross not your own, be honour and glory with the Father and the Holy Spirit, now and for ever. Amen. We say together, Holy God, holy and strong, holy and immortal, have mercy upon us. We finish our reflection for today.